Hello YouTube world and the world in general. Today we're gonna be making some custom thumbnails for your YouTube videos. If you are into that, uh, well let's get started. We're gonna be making uh, custom thumbnails for one of my videos and uh, we're gonna be uploading them at the end as well. So let's get started. Uh, we're gonna be using uh, Adobe Photoshop 12 and uh, also maybe a little bit of paint, Microsoft Paint into it. So let's get started. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and open up uh, Adobe Photoshop. I'm gonna say photo editor. Uh, we're gonna say file new blank file and we're gonna call this uh, YouTube thumbnail tutorial alright we know that YouTube requires a 2 megabytes is the max file size for the thumbnail and also it wants uh, suggested MSI needs to be a 1280 times 720 and then the supported format needs to be a JPEG, GIF, BMP and PNG. So right now we have MSI is already saying 2.64 megabytes right here at the bottom. Okay, so uh, we're gonna reduce this to uh, All right, so we're gonna make this width and a length of 900 times 720. And then uh, the reason for that is the, the max file size is two megabytes to upload as a thumbnail. So right now as 900 times 720 is giving us as 1.85 megabytes right here. So we're just gonna leave as that for now and click okay. Uh, before you click OK, make sure you guys change this to transparent right here, just like that. And we're going to click OK. All right. So here you guys, we have a workplace to work with. Now we know like whatever we're going to do here is somehow is good enough for YouTube thumbnail to work with. OK, so YouTube could understand our uh, thumbnail so it could show of a thumbnail on our videos okay. so uh, so now we have something to work on right here and now we're gonna have we're gonna have to I'm gonna have to find one of the one of my videos and we're gonna make a thumbnail out of it uh, all right so this is one this is my channel right here and I'm gonna pick one of the videos uh, which one I'm probably gonna pick the snowball mic unboxing and mic test video my number 10 video okay so uh, let's go for something like here alright so I'm gonna make this thing as one of my thumbnails so I'm gonna go ahead and print screen this well I'm gonna hit that a uh, print screen on my keyboard okay I'm gonna go under the uh, paint I'm gonna paste it I'm gonna get this part right here for my thumbnail so I'm, I'm gonna be needing this thing right here I'm gonna go ahead and pick this I'm gonna say copy then I'm gonna go ahead and call it a layer right here. I'm gonna say paste. Alright. So I'm gonna drag this down. Alright. So I'm gonna leave this as is. Uh, 
So I'm gonna make it another layer. I'm gonna give it a background to it. Maybe a graphic. Let's get a cool background in here. Uh, let's try. So I'm going to get one of these pictures in here. Let's go for something like this right I'm gonna go ahead and get this picture and go for the second layer I'm gonna paste it All right. I'm gonna call this uh, background I'm gonna call this uh, holding the mic, I guess. All right, I'm gonna make this bigger. I'm gonna right click it. I'm going to say right click on that, I'm going to say bring to front. Right. So with this picture, we just want me holding the mic on here, right? So I'm going to go ahead and get on the layer. I'm going to click right here, me holding the mic, layer, and then get this uh, magic wand tool, alright? So I'm going to click on magic wand tool, I'm going to click on here, maybe I'll turn this off, I'm going to turn that off. I'm gonna delete the access of it. Maybe I'll get a razor right here. How about a magnetic lasso tool? Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and zoom in and 200 percent So I see myself. I'm gonna go ahead and Get this uh, magnetic lasso tool. Crop out what I don't need. Right, I'm gonna do the same thing all around. I'm gonna hit delete. There goes that. I'm gonna delete this top part as well. Alright. So now we got something to work with here. I'm gonna change this to uh, 80%. Alright. I'm going to turn on the background. I'm going to get this. Zoom out a little bit. Alright. 
right? I'm gonna go ahead and get me another picture from a video. How about that one? Okay. Let's get this one as well. Let me say, uh, Go new. So what I need from this clip is this part. to my uh, Photoshop right here. I'm gonna click uh, another layer. I'm gonna get a edit, paste. Go ahead and resize this. get my uh, magic wand tool see if I'm gonna be on the layer I'm gonna call this uh, picture 2 and be on the layer right here I'm gonna go ahead and delete what I don't need maybe I get that this uh, magic lasso tool I'll get in there. This part either. I'm gonna say hit delete. Okay. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna keep on doing this until I get that perfect picture right. Because you want your pictures to be good. Alright. So like we got the majority of it down here uh, I'm gonna get this uh, eraser tool right here I'm gonna get that and be on that layer picture 2 and make my uh, size, the brush size right here maybe this one right here I'm gonna go ahead and delete what I don't want Okay. 
And I'll keep on using this lasso tool because it seems to be working fine right now. So let's stick with that. I want to zoom out a little bit. Let's call it 80%. Maybe I'll clean this up a little bit as well. So I want to be on the layer that I want to work I am working with. So now that we have a couple of pictures to work with, Alright, so now I'm going to go ahead and add some text into it. I'm going to say new layer. I'm going to call it Snowball Ice Unboxing. I'm going to move it up here. Then I'm going to make another layer. I'm going to say uh, Setup. Let's pick a different font for that. Mm -hmm. I'm going to say a new layer. I'm going to check this off. Once a new layer and call.
on there, there, there goes that. So now it's starting to look like a thumbnail, right? For YouTube. I'm gonna go ahead and make this uh, bigger. Alright. So, uh, how about we put in some effects into it? Put some stroke into it. The stroke is always stroke always looks good. Bevel always looks good. Right. Now I got some glow in here. Give it a little shadow right here, and just pop it out. And give it a little glow. Yes, that looks good for now. Let's go for this one. I'm gonna right click it. I'm gonna click on the layer, click on the picture, right click it, uh, edit layer. I'm gonna say uh, drop shadow. Let's make this one some other color. Give it that. Give it that. We'll give it a glow. So this now it starts to look like a thumbnail, don't it? All right. So after you're done with all that, you know, I'm gonna go ahead and change this to a different color. After you're done with how you want your uh, thumbnail to look like, then uh, make sure that you uh, save it and then upload it. Oh, we're gonna do that in a minute as well. Uh, let's try. Uh, this color 
You know, you could keep on going forever and make it look however you want it. But for now, let's just leave it as that. So this is going to be, let's just call this a thumbnail for one of the videos. I'm going to move this a little bit to this side. All right. You know, you guys, uh, it's just your own uh, ways, like what, how you want your uh, thumbnail to look like. I think for now, this is good enough. I'm going to leave this thumbnail for this unboxing. So, uh, yeah. So after you're done here, go ahead and save this file. I'm going to say yes. I'm going to say... Uh, I'm gonna save it as because like like I talked about it earlier YouTube wants your thumbnails to save as JPEG or a GIF so I'm gonna leave it as a JPEG file okay and I'm gonna say save I'm gonna say okay Alright, so we are done here making a thumbnail. So now we're gonna go back into YouTube and upload this thumbnail. Alright, so here's my video that we've been working with. I'm gonna go under video manager. Uh, where's my video? I'm gonna go under edit. Change. change image and I'm gonna look for that particular one I know it's a JPEG I'm gonna click on JPEG and here it is I'm gonna go open and YouTube gonna open it and there it is guys and I'm gonna say save back into my dashboard and here it is blue snowball mic unboxing and mic test that's my video number 10 so here it is guys so this is how your thumbnails gonna start looking right here so these were my other videos and this is what we just worked on so I'm gonna work on my thumbnails and make my thumbnails even more better than what how I have my thumbnails it's just my intro video I use that as thumbnails but now it looks much better than what I have here okay so so this was a tutorial to how to make thumbnails for your YouTube video and uh, thanks for watching as usual don't forget to uh, subscribe and follow me on Twitch and subscribe on YouTube channel alright until the next video 
I'll see you there.